Well, I think it's fantastic to have this competition here. This has been running for about 30 years and this is the first time we've had it in Cornwall. You know, Cornishmen travelled the world from probably about 1800 and took their skills and, and ideas with them. And here, if you like, what's happening, we've gone full circle. And it's now come all the way back. Mining games consists of mucking, which involves people shoveling into a cart and filling up as quick as possible. They have to push it down the track and push it back and, and then it's the quicker it's basically a timed event. Three, two. Then you've got Swede sawing, which is cutting bits of wood with a bow saw. Five people in the team, and you've got to cut through it as fast as you can. You've got surveying down at Holman's test mine, so that's basically you're given a start point and you have to find where the, where the end point is in the mine, and it's the closest one that wins. It's a 303 air leg drill, and you've got to punch two or three holes into concrete. Uh, you've got track laying, where you start off with uh, two pieces of track, five pieces of timber, dogs, which are nails, which you've got to dog in, uh, and then some hammers, so you've got to lay down as fast as you can, then they stop and then measure and see if your dogs are in correctly, and then they stop and then you start again and see how, how fast you can undo it in. So a good time for that is about under about five minutes. Gold panning, where you've got five pieces of lead shot, and some just gravel and you've got to go pan it as fast as possible. That's my favourite, the least amount of exercise. <laughs> You've got hand stealing, so you've got a hammer and a, and a chisel and you're just drilling into, into concrete. And then you've got a 10 minute block, so two minutes each to get as far down into concrete as you can. Camel School of Mines was set up in 1888 to, you know, because of the mining, mining boom in Cornwall and um, you know it's such a historic place there's 3,300 registered mines in Cornwall so you know it's it's rich heritage so it's, it's real good to be able to host it here. It's so cool to see the history and how much it's affected the communities in Cornwall and how the towns are built up around the mines and everything it's really cool. The pasties are awesome here much better than ours. <laughs> I hate this drum ball. Uh, and the overall winners were the Missouri B Girls. Well done. Come for Blake's prize. There's that fella. Well done, guys. The Walter Main Boys for taking the trophy. Well done, guys. I'm Dylan Gray, captains of the Wombats A team. Yeah, this has been our second year. It's, I'm absolutely stoked about it. Uh, we've trained really hard for it, and we really we came here confident. But it was a really tough competition. I was biting my nails the whole way through. Oh, it was great to compete in Cornwall. Like the guys here have set up the grounds really well. It's been really good experience. It's um, a lot of heritage here and a lot more culture. <laughs> <laughs>